The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge join the Prince of Wales and the Duchess of Cornwall at James Bond film premiere. It was a case of double Duchess at the world premiere of the new James Bond film tonight as the royals gave it the seal of approval. The Duchess of Cornwall and Duchess of Cambridge were accompanied by their husbands Prince Charles and Prince William, as the foursome attended the glittering world premiere of the eagerly awaited film No Time to Die. In a rare joint engagement, the senior royals stepped out onto the red carpet and met 007 star Daniel Craig, who looked dapper in a pink suede dinner jacket, and other cast members including Rami Malek, Lee Sadu and Lashana Lynch at the Royal Albert Hall in London. Kate looked stunning in a custom sparkling gold sequined Jenny Packham cape gown and wore her hair up to show off her beautiful gold earrings by Onitar. And when she greeted Bond actor Craig, he told her, you look jolly lovely. Camilla opted for a pale blue corseted chiffon dress with silver embroidery by Bruce Oldfield. Meanwhile, both Charles and William channeled 007 himself by wearing black tuxedos. The royals were also introduced to screenwriters Phoebe Wallabridge, Neil Purvis and Robert Wade, and multi-Grammy award-winning singer Billie Eilish and her musician brother Phineas O'Connell, who co-wrote the new Bond theme song. Charles, Camilla, William and Kate also chatted to producers Michael G. Wilson and Barbara Broccoli and director Kerry Joji Fukunaga. As part of the star-studded event, funds were raised for charities supporting serving and former members of the three intelligence agencies, the Secret Intelligence Service, the Security Service and GCHQ, as well as charities supporting past and present members of the UK Special Forces. Hundreds of healthcare workers and members of the armed forces also joined the royals in the auditorium to watch the film, as a thank you for their work during the Covid pandemic. The highly anticipated No Time to Die is the 25th Bond film and fifth and final movie featuring Craig as James Bond. It faced more than a year of delays due to the Covid-19 outbreak but is being released in UK cinemas on September 30th. No Time to Die takes place after Bond has left active service and is enjoying a tranquil life in Jamaica when his old friend Felix Leiter, played by Jeffrey Wright, from the CIA turns up asking for help. A mission to rescue a kidnapped scientist turns out to be far more treacherous than expected, leading to a mysterious villain armed with dangerous new technology. Heir to the throne Charles is patron of the British Film Institute, while his son William is president of the British Academy of Film and Television Arts, BAFTA. William and Kate attended the star-studded world premiere for the last Bond film, Spectre, in 2015, when they were joined by Prince Harry, before he met his now wife Meghan Markle and quit the royal family.